so my only advice I can usually give is based on my experience, and, and I'm here because of my writing, because I was a writer and a reporter first, and I honed that craft, and I, I worked at that craft, and everything came from that. But you have the right attitude in terms of the Swiss Army knife, because nowadays, you know, you have to be versatile um, and have to dabble in a lot of different platforms. You know, podcast to be in one of them. Yeah, I would say it all starts with a, the, the, the mechanism in which you may do things will always be fluid because of technology, like you may, it may be radio, maybe this, it may be that, but the basic structure doesn't change. It, focus on the journalism. You focus on the journalism, everything else will come. So uh, our business boils down to the basics. Can you tell people information they don't have? And can you develop a story? And so if you're able to do those two things, it doesn't really matter if it's a TV format or radio format, whatever. So right now, as a student, the biggest thing you need is reps. And um, if you're not writing for somebody, you need to write for somebody. Uh, and what I try to um, sort of, the message I try to give to students is that it's very competitive. And so the way that you get an edge and gain traction is by sometimes working for free, um, uh, you know, getting your foot in the door in places, but always yeah, kind of having a plan about where you eventually want to be. Anybody who has the job you want right now, you need to look at their resume and understand that the path that they went and see where your path is similar or where it's not. And But experience is your currency in this industry. So um, if you aren't getting experience, that needs to be your number one goal, is to get experience. The other, the other thing I'll add real quick before we get to my man's question, uh, Next to Carl, um, yeah, you gotta you gotta, you gotta be willing to uh, to deal with a lot of disappointment, stress, and heartache. Um, I mean, if we're sitting here now and laughing and joking, and you know, we got a great story, but I, somebody said I heard somebody said before, like, you know, you may want my glory, but you don't really want my story. And there's a uh, she and I are both here having persevered through a lot of setbacks, a lot of people saying no, a lot of people saying you're not good enough, a lot of people saying you don't fit what we're looking for, a lot of people saying you need more experience, we won't give you said experience. Um, so it's um, a lot of, and I guess in any walk of life, whatever, whether you want to be in broadcasting, whether you want to be a doctor, whether you want to be a lawyer, uh, it's, it's universal. So I would just, you know, decide how bad you want it, and don't, if it doesn't happen overnight, not to get discouraged. Because things, things change very quickly. There were many a day where I would drive home from Bristol and get to this one about how frustrated I was. And I was at ESPN, and you know, so I know that sounds crazy, but it wasn't always easy. So.